Uh, the first car out there is the Delage Hispano Suiza from 1926. It's got a little it was constructed in the 1980s period part, so it's not an original, original car, but it's still got all the same bits, including a 27-litre aero engine uh, in a land speed record design. It develops about 600 horsepower. Uh, this engine was originally fitted to a fighter plane, a D27 Dewalt Time. So that's an amazing car. Downton Abbey lovers, this is the Vauxhall Viper Aero that featured in the Downton Abbey race sequence, which you might remember, full of drama. So the chassis is a little old Vauxhall Viper. Now it used to have a four and a half metre four cylinder engine in it when it was born with just 40 horsepower. And out went the four and a half metre engine and in went a, uh, a Spanner Suiza V8 aero engine with 12 litres and pumping out more like 300 horsepower. So this is a classic sort of thing they did, they just took a, a regular little sports car and put these big aero engines in it. And these things, so many of them had no front brakes at all, skinny tyres. And in fact, these aero engine cars are what first got the Dell family interested in motorsports. My dad went to Brooklyn before the war and watched these aero engine machines thundering around the bank. The company's Brooklyn Museum is a place you can the wonderful day wandering around the history of our motorsport and the engine, of course. So that's the Vauxhall Viper Aero. is a 1914 to 1970. This is the Fafner Hall Scott Aero Special. The bodywork is actually a recreation of the factory team cars of the 1920s. Uh, the engine originally fitted with American standard five-blade engine. Yeah. It's a built sort of Fafner shaft. It's actually been found in New yes. Zealand. Uh, and it's a well-known designer and build of Oliver Way. So this is a chassis brought back from New Zealand. A beautiful new body on it. Oh no, that's the Paul Scott Aero yes. Special. I'm not sure whether this car um, created the word faffing about, but it could well be that this car racing in 1914 and the faff the team came, so there's a lot of faffing about, I guess. So as the faff that leaves the Lime Avenue, we're about to launch the most monstrous Isotta Franchini, a Fiat beast with a 27 litre aero engine in the front. Nothing behind the drivers, so you could just fall out the back, I guess, if things went wrong. You just abandoned shit by falling backwards out of the back of the car. Sorry? It's the chamber on the other side, so I see it. 
That's right, the side's wrong. Two. It's right on this side as well. Two is real. Yeah, exactly. Not quite sure I'd like to go round the brook of banking and the sotter Fracini, to be honest, personally. <laughs> but you see how bumpy the banking is when they go round about 130 crazy, miles an hour. You probably get thrown out the back even if you uh, didn't want to. <laughs> Things like the Chitty Chitty Bang Bang, that was another famous Brooklyn scar. And of course the, the Napier Rail Sim, which holds the outer circuit lap record. Uh, <laughs> incredible car. Oh. 